All right, guys, Ultimate Learning here. We're back for a different type of video today. I've got some of my younger scientists to help out. We've got Micah, we've got Elisha, we've got Kyron, we've got Nevei, Kazayo, and Dejano. Make sure you smash the subscribe and hit the like. All right, guys, so today's experiment is going to be all about dry ice. I'm sure, you've heard dry ice is just frozen carbon dioxide. This is about minus 79 degrees, about 10 times colder than your freezer. And the interesting thing about dry ice is that it doesn't melt. It turns straight into a gas and we call that sublimation. So here we've got some dry ice. As it sublimates, it forms a cushion underneath. So you can literally make a dry ice hoverboard. So what you want to do is aim to blow some bubbles in there. Oh, so nice. Can you give me one? Oh my god! All right guys, so for the next one, what we're gonna do is we're gonna add some dry ice to some warm water. It's gonna bubble up. And as it's releasing that carbon dioxide and water vapor, we wanna trap that bubble using a shoelace and some soapy water solution. Let's see what happens. Make sure that your shoelace is nice and soapy and you just want to wipe the shoelace across the top. Okay, might just do it another time. And you can see look all the carbon dioxide water vapor is being trapped in the bubble. Let's do that again. Let's do that one. It's important not to get any of the soap inside of the bowl. Just form a thin layer. Thank <laughs> you. 
we've got a bowl of warm water. To this warm water, we're gonna add our dry ice. And we're just gonna add a few drops of washing up liquid. You don't need to add that much. But this is what's amazing about this practical. Look at that. Alright then guys, what we're going to do now is we're going to make a dry ice cannon and you can see here, look, I've got a normal plastic drinking cup, I've cut a hole in the bottom just using some scissors and I'm going to cover the other end with some cling film and I'm going to hold that cling film in place with an elastic band. Okay, we're now ready to make our dry ice cannon. Just gonna put a few pieces of dry ice into our plastic cup and just pour a little bit of hot water in. And if I slowly Tap, we should get some smoke rings. Flash freezing some gummy sweets. Here I've got some gummy worms. Aww. And what if we could flash freeze our gummy worm? We're gonna use a toothpick. I'm just gonna place my gummy worm through the toothpick. And we're gonna use some alcohol. And we're gonna put some alcohol into our tequila cup. Yeah. 
Now alcohol's freezing point is about minus 114, which means when we add dry ice, we're gonna make like a cryogenic liquid. Watch what happens. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put our gummy sweet into this liquid and this will be about minus 80 and what we're gonna do is we're gonna flash freeze our gummy sweet Alright, so we've left our sweet for about 30 seconds in the dry ice and the alcohol and you can hear it's not gummy anymore. So we've got 10 kilograms of dry ice and we're going to dunk it into my parents' sink. 